Hello and welcome. This is D3W Gaming, and I am your host, D3W. And I have just finished the Mage Tower a few months too late. But uh, it was fun. Uh, it took a while. I didn't actually try till this weekend, so it was quite the challenge. I think I put like 60 attempts into it. Uh, but there is the new challenge right there. Uh, it's blue. And then we have a few different variations and colors based off completion. So you get this nice looking teal one that will match the transmog I have. Once I kill Hero, kill Jaden. Uh, that's going to happen on Tuesday. Uh, I got to win 10 rated battlegrounds for the red one. And then I just defeat all the Legion dungeon bosses and I'll get the yellow one. Which as soon as I get a full set of the yellow tier and white tier, I'll probably go with this one. Because this one's really easy to do. But for now it's just going to be the blue one. So, uh, yeah, uh, for the legendaries, um, since I am like 926, uh, I just used my base raiding ones for the first few parts. So the roots and the prides just kind of helped carry me through all the way to the final phase. And I was noticing that I was having a lot of issues with trying to take damage for uh, the ignite buff. So I ended up switching out the roots for another legendary. Uh, and then I was still having problems, and then I finally took off the Pride as, and it was immediately after that, I killed him. So, I just, you know, so high, I decided to get rid of these two. And um, it worked out, I think. From there, I set up a wardrobe, where I just put in what I needed for the Ultra Healy, which is going to be my two legendaries. And for that last phase, I just equipped these, which is the Soul of the Farseer, and also the Uncertain uh, Reminder. All right, and so one thing about the Farseer, you can pick your Cloudburst, and Cloudburst actually really helped in that last phase when I was focusing on the ads, um, but, you know, it wasn't really necessary, but I just wanted to get rid of Pride as, um to, you know, get that. So that's, you know, a lot of fun. So those are the legendaries I used for that. Uh, for the spec that I used, uh, Undulation, Gust of Wind, I could have done Graceful Spirit, but... I like jumping out of things with Gust of Wind, uh, Lightning Surge, Astro Guidance, Ancestral Vigor, Echo of Elements, and Ascendance. This is really close to my Mythic Plus uh, build, minus the Crashing Waves, and put Ancestral Guidance. I just think this is, you know, in a pinch, kind of helps with AoE healing, uh, especially in the last phase. So there's that, uh, and then, you know, I'm just going to put the video up there, so, you know, feel free uh, to watch it and uh, let me know how it is. I know this is a couple months too late uh but like i said i haven't really cared till just recently about getting it so you know whatever enjoy the video uh if you hate it please let me know if you like it please also let me know thank you